is Sefaraz Khan. Nice to meet you, Sefaraz. Am I pronouncing it correct? Yeah, yeah. You pronounced it correctly. Brilliant. Thank you. I do, I do ask because I know my name's difficult to pronounce, so I oh, like yeah. to get people's to pronounce it. So Yeah, right. Okay. So where are you from, ma'am? So I'm from the UK. UK. Um, but but I'm living in Tunisia. Um, so so yeah. Um, so can you? Uh, sure. Can for your confirmation or for your confirmation that I'm from. Mm -hmm. Okay. And can I ask why you're learning English? Uh, actually, that uh, I'm learning English. The reason is that. Uh, I am already, that means I have learned something, something of some English mm -hmm. like that, but I want to improve my English. Yeah. Okay. So, what, so what's your reason? Yeah, I want to improve my English fluency. That means like uh, exactly like in the native speakers, that how they speak correctly, mm -hmm. how they speak their vocal tone. I want to accept, I want to adapt that. Okay. Okay, so you're looking at kind of doing accent reduction. Exactly, exactly. That I'm looking for only accent. Okay. Now I will. I will be honest with you. I'm not experienced in accent reduction. Okay. Um, very good. Can you say that again? <laughs> uh, your accent is very good. You Thank are you. very good. You're very good at that. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. Um, we do have tutors on Cambly that do specialise in accent reduction. Oh sure. Um, and when you're when you're searching for a tutor, I think you can put in the search bar accent reduction, and it will come up with those tutors. Um, oh, like that. No problem at all. See, hopefully, uh, talking to you or having conversations with you. Mm -hmm. Hopefully that. I think, uh, I think uh, my grammar, then accent, mm -hmm. it will be seen, it will be observed, and then not only only, only I'm talking about accent, I'm talking about many things mm -hmm. like uh, many things come under English. Yeah, no, that's good though, and I think it's good to kind of look at it all round as well because. Even even teachers, even teachers have to brush up on on grammar. Um, sure. Every now and then. Exactly what you say. Yeah. About. Exactly right. Mm. So yeah, fine. Say, yeah. Uh, what, no, now my question is like uh, now I have a question is that what are the things required to speak very good English? Okay, practice. The more practical opportunity that you do get, okay. okay. So the more opportunity you get to speak. Okay. The, the quicker it does enhance, it does. Um, so it it, 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 yeah. The more I practice, the more I speak, the more uh, I would get my fluency. Yes. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm, you know, I'm talking about that. What are the things required to speak English? The only thing is practice, or is there anything else? I, the main one is is having that practical opportunity, speaking English as much as you can. Um, you can you can sit and you can read all the grammar rules. You can know all the vocabulary, but unless you get that opportunity, it you it are. goes to waste. So, so yeah. no, because I teach I teach my students uh, like I teach mm -hmm. my students. So they ah. are. What are the modes of learning English? What are the modes of speaking very good English? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. What suggestions mm -hmm. that should I? Uh, what should uh, suggestions should I give to them? Okay. And um, how do you teach in class? Can I? Uh, ask? I uh, yeah, sure. I teach sometimes. Mm -hmm. uh, at present, this is locked on time, so I'm unable mm -hmm. to teach online. Yeah. yeah. All the students that I visit, or some students visit to my house, then I teach some. Some of them I don't teach. Like uh, the number of students I don't teach. Mm -hmm. And simply that I teach only now online, so okay. I, I prefer to go for only offline because yeah. I interact with my students very well. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, they ask questions. They ask me the questions that what are the modes or how can I improve? What are the ways through which we can speak English better? Mm -hmm. um, a good way you can actually do like practice by yourself is by okay. doing like, have you ever heard of Toastmasters? Excuse me? Toastmasters. Okay. okay. So it's like a little community and they practice 
uh, like presentations, little speeches, but it's giving you that practice and it's something that you can do even by yourself. Um, so you might not be getting the conversational practice in, but you're one more thing, yeah. giving them topics, giving them topics, like uh, mm -hmm. giving them topics, you know, something about like that. Will yeah. that improve English? Will that help in improving English? It will, yes, um, because the, the more different the topics are, um, I don't know, have you ever done IELTS before or like TOEFL? Um, they choose they choose different topics and when you're practicing you learn these different topics because it's always enhancing your vocabulary your idioms um, even your the way in which you speak so you're looking at the intonation you're not just looking at saying the words or reading the words okay yeah there's all these so, yeah sure. um, so uh, have you ever been to India no, not like, yet. Would you, like to visit, would you ever uh, think, are you planning to come to India once? Um, I would love to visit, and I would love to visit, I think, is it Kerala? Kerala? I can't. Yeah. 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 It looks it like... A, it is it a southern looks, state country. Yeah, yeah, and it looks beautiful. It does, it looks sure. absolutely stunning. Um. Obviously, at the moment, we can't travel, <laughs> um, yeah, so, yeah. yeah. No, that's true, yeah. So, is, is there any question for me? Yeah. Is there, yeah, sure. You, is there any question that you want to ask me? Yeah, um, so where whereabouts in India are you from? What's your uh, state like? I'm from Jharkhand. There is a state, it's mm -hmm. named Jharkhand. Okay. Yeah, it's it's an uh, it's about uh, one thousand kilometers far from Delhi. It's mm -hmm. the capital of India. It's our country that means India. Ah, okay. I've never so it's heard about of... one thousand. No, it's about one thousand kilometers from you. Oh wow. Hmm. Okay. So, um, what's what's special about that state? What's special about that area? Uh, very good. It has a steel plant. It has coal mines. Wow. It has natural resources you can talk about. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Steel plants, then uh, we, uh, from this place, uh, I think from this Chargon state, we generate electricity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nah. That I have to visit also. That I haven't also, I haven't also visited my old states, uh, mm -hmm. like all the places of the states you can talk about. Yeah, no, no, it just sounds quite interesting because I know India is so diverse in terms yeah, you're right. of, yeah. of not just cities but also cultures as well. And culture, it, yeah, yeah, culture, and religion, then caste. All the people mm -hmm. are, you know, all the people are together. They celebrate the festivals very well. They mixed mm -hmm. their thoughts, their feelings, mm -hmm. share their feelings. It, all the things, all the festivals, very joyously. Yeah, it is. I think it's wonderful. I do think it's absolutely yeah. wonderful. Um, so where would you recommend somebody who's never been to India, where would you recommend they visit and go? Uh, if you talk about, I would uh, recommend him or her, whoever, mm -hmm. to visit to Agra, the Taj Mahal there is. Okay, you know, and uh, all, I think uh, I can tell that there are a number of very beautiful places over there in, in our country. Mm -hmm. But the first I would give that to visit to Accra because that there is a Taj Mahal. Yeah. And then beautiful cities are there. Mm -hmm. uh, beautiful cities are there. They can, a number of monuments, historical monuments. Mm -hmm. Like uh, we, uh, we, uh, we were freed from, you know, uh, like Britishers yeah. long ago. <laughs> A number of physical monuments are still there. Okay. So they can come and take them to go also there, to those places. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, that's good. That's good. I know my auntie, um, she has visited India. She's been twice. Um, and each time she went for, for six months. So she traveled through different parts. Um, did she? Oh, can you, can you say that again? No, I'm, I'm saying that. Which place did she visit? Um, quite a lot of places. I know she went to okay. the Taj Mahal, um, okay. the, the Rat Temple. 
the temple of the temple where there's all the rats. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, these are. <laughs> um, so places, and I think that you might, uh, she might have got, no, she might have taken number of photographs too. Yes, oh. a lot. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of things. You are very good. Mm. So, you know, you want to visit to India once again, once because that uh, you would get to see a lot of things that, mm -hmm. and you will get to learn also a lot of things. Yeah. Uh, exactly. That. You know, I'm also wishing to come to uh, the place where you're talking about United Kingdom, mm -hmm. but, uh, you know, you know mm -hmm. uh, uh, air, uh, air force, mm -hmm. I think we cannot. Uh, reserve the tickets so we can go also at this moment. Yeah. Have you have you ever visited the UK? No, sure. no, no, no. I, I think uh, I would visit, uh, I would love to visit mm. first of all that would go to Saudi Arabia mm. and I'm planning to go up that. Uh, yeah, no, at the moment I wouldn't recommend travelling at all. No. Um, <laughs> that's true. Yeah, fine. Very good. Yeah. Okay, uh, one more thing that's so far my that how is my English conversation? Is it mm -hmm. is it good? Yeah, I actually think you have a great command of English. Okay. What I might look at a little bit is just slowing down your speech in in certain times, okay? Because sometimes it speeds up just a little bit too much, and I do have to listen quite intently, okay? okay. Um, yeah. But overall, no, I think that in, I, th I think that uh, talking with the Kamli tutors and the number of Kamli tutors, they have really, you know, they got this point. They said that please slow down the, your speed, mm -hmm. uh, the space, the pace of your speaking style is really something is faster. Mm -hmm. So it's just slow down. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, I'm I'm working on it. Yeah, no, that's good. That's good. And you know it's a point to work on as well. Um, I <laughs> I have to do it. Um, when I talk sure. to my mom or, like, my family, my friends, I speak okay. really fast. And I speak in my local <laughs> dialect. If I did that on Cambly, nobody would understand me. So, really? yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you, have any, do you know any other languages? Do you know any any other language besides English? Um, I know a little bit of French, and I'm learning Arabic. So, so yeah. Arabic. Um, okay. Like, uh, do you have any friends? Uh, like, uh, they are from Saudi Arabia or something Arabic countries? Uh, yes, my husband. He's Tunisian. Are you alright? Yes. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, What's his name? Sure. So, what is it you? Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah. So. Oh. Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, you know, I just asked that. Uh, what is it you? What's his profession? Okay. What's his profession? Actually, a DJ. Um. DJ. DJ. So he plays DJ. DJ. So he plays the music in in the nightclub. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Very good. Yeah. So I think that in your house, I think that you enjoy it because that uh, there is a home theater, a lot of things that maybe they were in your house. Yes. <laughs> Sometimes it is too loud. Um, so, so, yeah. I'm <laughs> you that, no, please, let me reduce some sound, the sound, something. Mm -hmm. um, no, I'm angry too with uh, at the means that particular moment at that particular work that you please reduce some sound mm -hmm. uh, uh, volume of that sound like that. Uh, yeah, normally normally he um, he won't do anything while I'm working or while I'm teaching, which is good. And yeah, he's got like all the equipment and stuff. So I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Uh, maybe the next time that because of my uh, I think that my time slot. Mm -hmm. I think time is yeah. Really about to end so yeah very quickly i don't know that i really wanted to more on but, but unfortunately that i reserved only for 15 minutes no problem so it has been lovely to okay. meet you though uh, uh so please uh, send me send me your schedule that hopefully that uh, i may connect to you in future to in like in the next week too yeah brilliant. okay what mm, sure one more thing then.